hi guys assalamu alaikum welcome back to my channel uh, today i am here to uh, make a special video of uh, some of my uh, subscriber uh, comments reply so uh, the comments uh, goes here uh, the subscriber is viren cabinet he is uh, uh, simultaneously asked uh, me to do a special video for him because uh, he already said that uh, i am his last hope so i don't know uh, 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 exactly i am his last hope or not but uh, i just tried to uh, solve uh, this issue so this is the comments uh, he asked me to take two buttons and one file browser initially on page load second button should be disabled once you uh, once i select first uh, file using file browser then uh, second button uh, to validate the file is empty or not using javascript but uh, i i don't use javascript here because uh, this is the most advanced concept and uh, recently i have uh, not that types of issue here but i can fix it uh, using uh, only oracle apex uh, dynamic action okay so uh, let's uh, jump to our uh, page now i uh, already uh, created that page and just uh, run it and then finally we'll we'll see the issue is solved or not okay let's see we have uh, see here and here is the comments uh, he asked me to take two buttons and one file browser so i already uh, take a region as black uh, blank region so static contents uh, i just uh, take one file browser uh, and validate it uh, is not null then i will i take two buttons one is a uh, uh, button one and second one is button two so first uh, button i use a submit page and uh, another uh, dynamic action i ask the but uh, i say the dynamic action to disable my first button and finally i run it and uh, uh, would like to see the output here uh, first of all i select uh, click on browse and nothing select and uh, first of all we see that uh, the button is uh, already disabled here and this is his uh, first requirement so i can disable that uh, when phase page load uh, after phase load the button uh, is already dis uh, disabled so if i don't select uh, something or anything from here nothing from here then when i press this button uh, this will validate me uh, please select a file okay uh, i just um, make a, a just uh, I just make a condition that uh, the file uh, must not be empty okay just um, I use <coughs> the validation here and uh, say that uh, the file browser is not empty that's why uh, I, I give a message here please select a file okay then uh, this al al already asks me to select a file so then it's uh, so I, if I can select uh, anything so then uh, the error will not happened exactly so i just uh, click uh, on the image and open it uh, then uh, when i press the button then uh, there is no error uh, exactly present here and he also asked me that uh, using javascript and uh, if the returns true then my second button should be enabled but uh, i i i uh, am not sure what he exactly want uh, so i request viren cabinet uh, that if you are uh, really want to do that uh, uh, then first call me or first tell me that uh, what types of javascript or what operation exactly you want to uh, operate here so please uh, comments me or uh, knock me at my uh, whatsapp uh, my whatsapp number already uh, provided in my channel so uh, we can uh, discuss more decently there then I will uh, hopefully I will uh, solve the last issue that uh, second button uh, which is uh, you would like to uh, enable the second button because uh, first of all you can already uh, have issue here then you can see that the PLSQL code uh, but I don't know exactly what types of PLSQL code you want to run here and uh, what is your exact PLSQL code so if you uh, discuss more deeply with me uh, then hopefully I can uh, uh, solve the issue but I think uh, th there, there is already a solution you have uh, you can try uh, after this portion 
uh, then hopefully you will uh, get your uh, desired result after your JavaScript and uh, PSQL code added here okay and nothing else uh, then uh, I can uh, more deeply uh, elaborate that things here uh, first of all I create a page uh, as a blank page okay then uh, I just uh, take a, uh, a region called button validate and uh, it's a static contents I take it as static contents then then I add a uh, add three items one is file browser and uh, second two uh, you desire button one and button two uh, first one uh, in file browser I use a validation uh, that uh, my file browser output is not empty uh, that's why uh, I provide a message here then I take two buttons uh, first button I use a submit uh, page because uh, uh, for further operation and uh, then uh, second button uh, I use a dynamic action uh, called the uh, call when phase load uh, the button is disabled it's, it's too simple but if you uh, your requirement is not service here you can knock me anytime okay thank you so much uh, thank you and uh, see you next video and hopefully those who are stuck here uh, about a button validation uh, hopefully you will get your answer so those who are not subscribed my channel still now please uh, subscribe my channel and bring with uh, and stay with me so thank you so much see you next video uh, after then a lapis